So what if I told you that you could start a brand new YouTube channel from scratch and start getting millions of views like this guy right here and start making money using nothing but YouTube shorts? Or like this girl started a brand new channel and is now getting over a million views per month? Or this guy getting 10 million views per month just from YouTube shorts? In this video, not only will I be showing you three channels of everyday people who are crushing it with YouTube shorts, but I'm actually gonna be showing you how to do this without ever creating videos yourself. It's a very unique strategy that almost no one is talking about right now. Plus, if you stick around to the end of this video, I'll also be showing you two bonus ways to monetize your videos using a very similar strategy that I use on my TikTok accounts that make me well over $100 per day in profit. All right, so the first step to make your first thousand dollars with YouTube shorts without making videos is to actually pick a niche that you're gonna post your shorts around. Now, I'm gonna be showing you a couple examples in just a second, but if I go into my computer here, um, a quick little hack you can use to find different niches and you know different channels that are using shorts and making money from them is literally just go to the YouTube search bar and you're gonna type in hashtag shorts and then you can press the plus icon and you can see all the different short niches there are, right? So there's shorts weight loss, there's gadget shorts, there's travel shorts, there's motivation ones, there's make money online ones, there's affiliate marketing. You can see all the different niches there are. So for example, if we just click on shorts plus gadgets, maybe you wanna go into the gadgets niche, as we can see, there's some examples of shorts that are showing you cool gadgets, right? This is their whole niche. Here's an example, right? Smart appliances, gadgets for every home. This video alone has 77 million views. Or for example, we can come back here, I'm just gonna delete gadgets, and now I can go and search, let's say, for example, uh, shorts cryptocurrency. And I can see all the different shorts that are being posted around cryptocurrency, for example, this one. So that's the first way of finding a niche for YouTube shorts, and that will also be helpful to find all kinds of content ideas for whatever niche you're gonna go into. Now, let me actually show you some real examples of people who are crushing it with YouTube shorts right now. And this is just a girl named Crypto Wendy, and she makes content around you know, cryptocurrency. And actually I was looking at her channel and I found this very, very fascinating. If I go to the oldest videos on her channel, right? I just sort by oldest right here. We can see that when she first started posting YouTube videos around cryptocurrency and all that different stuff, her videos were barely getting any views, right? Maybe a couple hundred views per video. But now if I go to the sort section and I go to her most popular videos, meaning these are the videos that are getting the most amount of views on her channel, as we can see, when she started posting YouTube shorts and she started taking YouTube shorts seriously, these are her most viewed videos. She went from getting a couple hundred views to getting you know, 691,000 views, 642,000 views, 441,000 views, 881,000 views, literally just from posting YouTube shorts. And you can see if I go to her newest videos, her shorts have got her a whole bunch of subscribers and now when she's posting regular videos on YouTube that she can monetize way better, as we can see now they're getting thousands of views. So shorts really helped her build up her whole channel and now she's not just getting views on her short videos but her longer form videos that she was posting, now she's getting a whole bunch of views from those because she has a huge subscriber base built out from the YouTube short videos she's been posting. So that's gonna be the first way you can actually make money from YouTube shorts is finding some kind of niche and posting shorts around those, building up subscriber base and not only making money from YouTube ads, but also making money from you know, promoting affiliate products, right? And making commissions through different products you're promoting around the crypto niche. Now, that's the first way, right? Is actually posting the videos yourself. You're actually filming the videos. That's a great strategy. It's free to start. Anyone can do it. However, if you're someone who just does not want to make videos, you don't want to make content yourself, let me show you another very cool strategy that I guarantee you, you haven't heard anywhere else. So if I go to TikTok, as we can see, TikTok is very similar to YouTube Shorts, and this is one of my TikTok accounts. And you might be wondering, Chad, who is this girl, right? Obviously, you're not making these videos, right? Someone else is. And this is the second strategy you can use to make money with YouTube Shorts, is actually hiring some kind of freelancer to make your content for you, to make videos for you, right? So I actually hired this girl, she is a freelancer, and I pay her around 20 to $25 per TikTok video she made. And as we can see, right, this is basically, she's just showing you the best online jobs to work from home. 
right? And we're just making content around those different jobs, right? And you can see some of these videos that, for example, this video got 682,000 views. I paid her $20 to make that video, but in return, this video has made me over $1,000 in commissions from the email list I've been building up from it. And also I'm promoting a product if you see the link in my bio. So that's your other option is you can go to a freelancer. You can post a local ad in your city and you can offer someone, you know, around $20 per TikTok video they make you or per YouTube short they make you. And personally, what I would do is not just post these on YouTube shorts, right? But also post them on TikTok, post them on IG Reels, because now you're getting three pieces of content on different platforms from literally just paying someone $20, right? So for example, if I post around 15 times per month on this account, this account is only going to cost me around $400 per month to run. So if I can get my YouTube channel, my TikTok, my Instagram account from these videos making me $2,000 per month, $3,000 per month. Again, that $400 per month is always going to stay the same price. So that means it's going to be super profitable for me and I'm going to make great money and I can do this for as many accounts as I want, right? This is just one person I'm hiring. I can hire as many people as I want to because I'm not actually creating the videos myself. So that's one example. If you don't want to actually create the videos yourself, um, let me show you another example. This is another uh, TikTok account that I found and she does really well at promoting very unique products on TikTok that she's an affiliate for. So she's actually promoting more physical products and this would be a great niche. Like for example, if we go back to the YouTube shorts um, and we type in gadgets, this is kind of similar to what she's doing. However, hers is more like trendy products, but we can see like these kind of videos, gadgets, cool little physical products that you know people just didn't know about. These videos do really good on YouTube shorts. As you can see, this has 83 million views. So for example, if we just go to her account, as we can see, all she's doing, she's making a video saying Amazon party must haves. And you know, most of the time she's not even showing her face in the video. So for example, if we just play this video, Amazon party must haves. First are these wine drops that eliminate your headache after drinking a glass of wine. And it only takes 20 seconds before you can take a sip. Next are these set of seven felt wine markers that hook on the stem of your wine glass so you never have to worry about mixing up your glass with a friend's. And lastly are these magnetic drink markers that can be attached to your specific shot glass, champagne flute, martini glass, whatever you're drinking out of, and they're super easy to attach and remove. So that's a video, and as you can see, her description is links are in the bio, right? So if people want any of these products, and keep in mind, she's posting videos like this literally every single day. She's finding all kinds of cool products that people would use on a daily basis. And you know, she's just leaving her link in the bio and people can go shop on her Amazon store. And as you can see, if they buy any of these products that she's recommending on her Amazon store, obviously she's gonna make commissions from everything that you buy from Amazon. So those are some examples of real people who are crushing it with these short videos, whether it's on YouTube shorts, TikTok, IG reels, right? You get the point. They're basically all the same videos. I would literally just post them everywhere. And now I actually want to talk about how to actually come up with these videos, right? How to find videos that you're going to make. So whatever niche you decide you want to do your YouTube shorts around and your TikTok around your IG reels around, right? Whatever that niche is. Now you want to figure out how to come up with content for that niche, right? So if you are in the gadgets niche, literally what I would do is just, you would find similar people in that niche, right? So this is an example, uh, we have new smart utility, or for example, we have better deals. Uh, we have smart home gadgets, right? So if we're just going to click on smart home gadgets and we want to see what videos are doing really well, as you can see, they're posting like five videos every single day. So they're putting out a lot of content, which gives us all kinds of ideas. If we're going to go into a niche like this, or maybe you decide you don't like the format of these videos. So you just want to go find another channel that you can model. Right, so I would go back up here, I'd find better deals. And I would see like, okay, can I make a video like this? Am I able to make a video like this? Can I order this product and make a cool video showing off this gadget and then eventually leaving the link in the bio where people can go and buy these gadgets and you can make money. Or for example, if I wanted to go in the crypto niche, right, I would come to this person's channel who's crushing it with YouTube shorts and crypto and I would literally just go sort to the most popular videos and see which of her recent videos is doing the best for her. So for example, we can see that this video was only posted four months ago. It has 691,000 views. I know that this video will probably do good on a brand new channel if you're creating a brand new one. 
right? It'll probably do pretty good because keep in mind, it's not like all her, all these views came from her subscribers, right? Four months ago, she probably only had 100,000 subscribers. So you can see that this video is getting recommended to all kinds of people who are interested in cryptocurrency. So that's one way is just to find YouTube channels that are similar to the niche that you're gonna go into and just looking at their most popular videos, looking at their most recent videos that did well and remaking those, putting your own spin on them and kind of just modeling those for yourself. Now, another way you can do this is obviously you can go on TikTok and you can sort by the most popular videos. So there's actually a Chrome extension. It's a really cool Chrome extension that's completely free to use. And you can see it right here. If I go to the top here, it's called sort for TikTok. If I just click on this Chrome extension and I press start here, what's gonna happen is it's gonna find all the videos on their TikTok account that they have posted. And it's gonna find the most popular videos that she has posted on her account. So as we can see, this video has 27 million views. And if we go on this video, things you didn't know you needed off Amazon. And as we can see, if we go throughout the video, let me mute this. Um, she's just, you know, giving the hook and then she's showing different products. So she's literally ordering the products to herself and she's showing them off. She's showing how cool they are. And if we do the math on this, just cause I'm pretty curious, let's say this product costs uh, $50, right? It looks like it's a, like an ice cream maker. So if this product costs $50 and she's making, let's say even a, like a 4% commission on Amazon, she's making around $2 per sale from this product. Well, if this got 27 million views, let's say even just a half percent of people went and bought this product from her link. Right, if we do 27 million, okay, I think that's 27 million. If we do times 0 0.005 and we equal this out, as we can see, that's 135,000 sales. We times that by two. This video could have made her $270,000 in commission. So that might be a little high, but I bet you this video alone, she made at least $50,000 in commissions, which is absolutely insane. And again, she might have a YouTube channel where she posted this and it got another 10 million views, or maybe she also posted this on Instagram and that got her another 5 million views, right? The potential of this is absolutely crazy if you can get some of your videos to go viral. So again, that's kind of how I come up with content is just going on YouTube, seeing the most popular videos and also going on TikTok seeing her most popular videos on here, or if we go into another niche, right? Let's say my TikTok account, as we can see, I have 122,000 followers on my TikTok account. All I have to do is I just press, you know, sort for TikTok, press start, and it's gonna pull up my most viewed videos on my TikTok account, right? And obviously I'm more in the side hustle slash make money online niche on this account. So if you were going into this niche, I would go on my videos and kind of see the most popular videos and this is gonna give you some great ideas for your own content if you're going into a niche like this. Okay, so now I wanna talk about actually creating the video. So this is where you need to decide which strategy are you gonna do? Are you gonna pick the strategy where you're actually gonna create the videos yourself, it's completely free to start, or are you deathly afraid of making videos, you don't wanna do that, and you wanna hire someone else to make videos for you? you need to decide on which strategy you're gonna do right now. Now, once you actually pick which strategy you wanna do, now's the time to actually create the video. So if I actually go into one of these videos, right, there's a certain script I use, like the way I got these videos to go viral, right? This video, 437,000 views, 1 million views, 1.2 million views, is there's a certain script I use that pretty much guarantees my video to go viral almost every single time I make them. And that script really comes down to three things. The first three to five seconds, you want it to be the hook of the video. What's gonna make people keep watching? Now the next, like let's say 30 seconds or so, 20 seconds or so, that's where you wanna actually show the process of whatever that hook was, right? So you actually wanna show yourself you know, for exa this example, I'm testing TikTok side hustles, right? So if we actually go into this video and watch it, you can see right off the bat, the hook is testing TikTok side hustles. So for example, testing TikTok side hustles so you don't have to, part number one, a bunch of people. On and now, right, that's the first three seconds of the video. It got their attention. Now the middle part of the video, which is the majority of the video, the 20, 30 second long part, is actually testing the side hustle, right? Or delivering whatever your hook said. So now I'm actually going through and I'm testing the side hustle. I'm showing how it works. 
And then at the very end of the video, right, the last five seconds, this is where you wanna actually show the results. So now at the very end of the video, I'm showing how much money I actually made and I'm basically saying if I recommend doing the side hustle or not. Or if we go back to this video, right? As we can see, the, the hook is very clearly things you didn't know you needed off Amazon, right? That's the hook, that's the first three to five seconds. And now the rest of the video or the majority of the video is actually showing the products that you know people had no idea existed off of Amazon, but something like everyone needs, right? In this case, it's a product that uh, it looks like it basically just turns fruit into ice cream, right? As we can see, that's the majority of the video. And then the very end is actually showing the end result, which is her actually eating the ice cream, right? So what's the end result? The reason why they watched the whole video, that's what you wanna put at the end. So that's the script I would use to create my videos, whether you're hiring someone else to create videos for you, or if you're actually creating the videos yourself, no matter what niche you're in, no matter where you're posting the video, whether it's on TikTok, whether it's on YouTube Shorts, whether it's on IG Reels, that's the script you're gonna to use to make these viral videos so you can get all kinds of views and eventually start making all kinds of money from these videos that you're making. All right, so once you get creating the video down, now really all you need to do is actually upload the video to your YouTube channel or to your TikTok account. In this case, we're using YouTube Shorts. So for example, right, all you're gonna do is you're gonna go to your YouTube channel and you're gonna go to this little icon right here and you're gonna press upload video. Now I'm just gonna pull up the file, so I'm gonna press select. I'm gonna go to downloads here and I'm gonna upload this video right here. And that's basically it. Right now here's where you just put your title, your description, and you can have links in here as well. And then you just go through here and here's where you can actually select if you wanna monetize the video or not with the ads. And then from here you kinda of just go through the steps and you'll eventually be able to publish the video live on your YouTube channel. So that is how you upload the video. Now obviously the whole reason you're here which is gonna bring me to the last step of this entire process of making money on YouTube Shorts, which is actually monetizing your videos. So like I said in the beginning of this video, if you stuck around to the end, I'm gonna be showing you two bonus ways you can actually monetize your videos. I currently use these ways to monetize videos on TikTok, and it makes me well over $10,000 per month in profit. So anyways, the first way you're gonna be monetizing these videos is through affiliate marketing. This is basically just finding some kind of product you wanna promote and getting an affiliate link for that. And every time someone clicks on that link and buys that product that you're recommending in your videos, you're gonna make a commission of that sale. So if you're in a niche where you're doing like cool Amazon products like this girl, or you're doing, let's say a niche where it's cool gadgets, right? Smart home appliances, home cleaning, inventions for the kitchen. If you're doing one of these channels where you're talking about and showing different physical products, this is where I would literally just leave a direct affiliate link to the products that you're talking about in that video. So for this case scenario, as we can see, they're just leaving the link in the description. And if you click on this link, right, this is where you, know, you can see all the products that they're recommending. So they actually categorize this in different um, categories. So that's the first thing I would do. And obviously these are all affiliate links and they're signed up to the Amazon Associates affiliate program. So that's gonna be the first way you can monetize your YouTube short videos. Now, if you're in a different niche, let's say you're in the niche of make money online, affiliate marketing, or you're in cryptocurrency, anything where you're gonna promote some type of software or digital product, basically anything but a physical product, this is where I would take a little bit different approach and I would actually build out a funnel for the niche that you're in. So for example, if I go back to this account um, where I hired this freelancer to make TikTok videos for me, right? As we can see, this niche she's in is basically like the best work from home job. So if we click the link in the bio, it actually goes to this page where I'm actually taking them to my own website. This is what I call an opt-in page where I'm basically giving them some kind of free incentive for them to opt in. So in this case scenario, it's take the free quiz. If they click on this button, as we can see, we're asking for their name and email. So the reason why we do this is we wanna build up an email list of people who are interested in finding social media jobs. And as we can see, if we put in their name and email and press get instant access, not only am I building up my email list, but I'm also taking them directly to my affiliate link. As you can see, here's my affiliate ID. This is a ClickBank product. And if they eventually go through this quiz and buy the product that it recommends, 
right? I'm gonna make a commission on that sale. And again, if they don't buy right away, right? Keep in mind, I'm building up my email list so I can start following up with them and promote the same exact product in my email marketing as well. And as we can see, if I go to my personal TikTok account, Chats Hustle, as you can see, I'm doing the same exact thing for this account right here. Instead of taking them directly to an affiliate link, I'm taking them to a funnel where I'm building up an email list and I'm promoting products to them on the back end. And at the same time, I'm building up my email list. I'm building up a digital asset. And doing it this way, when you're promoting some type of software or digital product, you can make a lot more money when you're actually taking them through your own funnel, putting your own recommendation on the product, and actually building up an email list and following up with them via email marketing. So anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video of me showing you the fastest way to your first thousand dollars with YouTube Shorts. Let me know in the comments which strategy you're gonna use for this. Regardless, they're all great strategies. And if you guys wanna learn more about how to monetize these accounts through affiliate marketing and how to get other traffic sources, I just launched a five-day affiliate marketing challenge showing you not only how to get your funnel set up and how to start affiliate marketing, pick products to promote, but also how to go out there and make your first sale in this five day challenge. So anyways, if you want access to that challenge, that'll be the first link in the description below, or just go to this link right here. We're normally gonna sell this challenge for $97, but since I just recently launched it, you can get access to the entire challenge for just $1. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, all I ask you drop a like and subscribe if you're new. It lets me know you want more videos like this. With that being said, as always, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I will see you in my next video.